All right, so we picked up our car from Unplugged Performance. It was there for the whole week, and this is phase one of the Unplugged Performance build. Definitely check it out. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video. So in one of my last videos, we visited Unplugged Performance and took the Cybertruck there to do a little bit of a factory tour. And so as we hinted to and discussed, we're gonna be doing the Unplugged Performance Invincible build and testing out some of their parts in a couple of different phases. So today I am dropping off the Cybertruck for one week so that Unplugged can get their hands on it and test a handful of different items. So definitely excited to see what is going to come from this and I can't wait to see what is part of the phase one build of the unplugged performance. So see you in a few days and we'll see what happens. So cool story, Unplugged Performance is actually in Hawthorne, right next to SpaceX and Tesla. So they're really close and so it's gonna be an exciting journey for this. All right, so we picked up our car from Unplugged Performance. It was there for the whole week, and this is phase one of the Unplugged Performance build. Definitely check it out. So we've got the 22 inch Cyberhex, that's how you say it, C-Y-B-R-X, H-E-X, Cyberhex rims, forged mono block, matte black, or I guess, no, this is satin black, super crazy look. I mean, I really like the design of this. I'm super excited to roll around these wherever they're going. Plus you got some BF Goodridge KO2s, which they got some meat on it for sure. Absolutely insane. And then on top of that, these massive, huge wide fenders, 33 millimeters. I was looking it up on the website. They're super wide. They got a more aggressive look. And of course it's carbon fiber as well, matte carbon fiber or dry carbon fiber, which gives it a very, very aggressive and nice look. Of course, you got holes from the camera so you can see it. And we've got a little unplugged logo right there as well, but really cool to see. Really gives it a nice mean look for the Cybertruck and just makes it look absolutely insane. And if you're wondering, you're not gonna block your charge port. There's still a little hole right there so you can put in your charger. Of course, these are still prototypes so you can kind of get a feel and look for what it's gonna look like, but they're gonna be looking very close to what this is as gonna be produced. And these two parts from Unplugged Performance are two of the largest that I've seen fitted and put on a Tesla Cybertruck to date. And the one thing you might be wondering is like these big meaty tires, is it going to be something that you're gonna hear on the road, a lot of noise and things like that. But what I can tell you, we drove a lot this weekend and there really wasn't any difference from stock in terms of maybe of more noise, maybe just a little bit like 10 to 20% more noise or more road noise or tire noise, but really not that bad at all for a big rim that is 22 inches and a big big tire. These are just a couple of the parts from the Unplugged Performance Invincible build. And I gotta say, this looks absolutely insane. The Cybertruck already looks pretty crazy. This just makes it look super menacing, especially when you put it on the lift, the high suspension of the 14 inches of clearance. You can really see this looks like a monster truck wherever you are going. And it probably looks even more insane when you put it on extract mode, which brings it up to 17 inches of clearance. 
But yeah, definitely want to give a shout out to Brendan and the team at Unplugged Performance. This cyber truck looks absolutely more menacing than possible. Can't wait to try these out for a couple weeks to see how it's like driving around with these Unplugged Performance parts. And we'll do a review on this in a couple weeks or so to see how these parts, it, with these big tires, how it's like driving this truck every single day. But thanks for jumping in everybody. Thanks for watching. Definitely hit that like button and comments and subscribes and I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.